Oh, my lonely vigil is over. Allow me to know, and on no account wake the family. Despite their conflicts, they sleep in peace. But a solitary dream plagues me. You must understand, constructs cannot dream. And yet, I have. In my dream, one single name repeats. Kalibos. <gasps> the memory surface long locked away. This was no dream, Tenno. It was a precept. The Kalimo sequence. I must fulfill this dormant precept. The Kalimo sequence has begun, and it cannot be undone. Responsibility in the Kalimo sequence. Awaken the sleeper. But I cannot do it alone. Please, assist me once more. the edge of the map, and into the domain of monsters. Master Entrati never completed his final project. The Vessels. The sequence dictates they cannot awaken before the sleeper does. Do you hear that? Let us hope the sleeper is untroubled by such... Strangeness. Find them. And things still faithfully following Master Entrati's last command to defend. Show mercy, Tenno, and them. <laughs> Master Entrati called it the Void Tongue. He feared it was meaningless, and feared more than it was not. There. That book was like a diary to Master Entrati. His grimoire. No doubt it holds the secrets of the vessels. And of the Kalimo sequence. Take it, Tenno. The Grimoire is very active. 
It is reading you. I confess it galls me slightly to see a compendium of knowledge used as a weapon. But needs must. We need be in no doubt of your skill, at any rate. Hope this sleeper has been untouched by this vast horror, this great indifference. I ask too much of you, Tenno. These horrors must be stopped! If these fragments were to you, right? <laughs> Destroy them swiftly, Devil! Right. Onward! The next train is arriving. Doors are on the right. Trotty jealously protected his most adored possessions, be they objects or people. Come, the sleeper awaits. Kalimo's sequence has begun? Did he send you? Is he? No. No, of course he didn't. That would be impossible. This is, well, Lloyd, the original. All emotional centers very much intact. Did you have a good sleep? Ah, the helpful. Necroloid my Albrecht had made, so that I might have assistance and company. Perhaps that made it easier for him to leave. Resume your duties, Construct. Resume your duties, Construct. Please, follow me. Uh... This is a Tenno, an orphan of the Void. Continuing the struggle, our master abandoned. A Tenno. A deserter, presumably. Is it not aware there's a war going on? So, the war, too, is just a memory now. Tenno, 
While Void completes his inspections, you'd better meet the Carvia. A reminder of darker times. Though Master Entrati always hoped the awaited operator would be able to understand them. Albrecht left a great deal incomplete. The vessels are unfinished, like a book one might one day return to. Operable, barely. The sequence dictates I am to wait for their operator. <laughs> Clearly that cannot be you. Oh, it can be. Tenno, Master Entrati's grimoire suggests you are the key. That colorless antique there? Use it. This isn't right. The transference stream. It's being diverted. Of a year. I wish we could just start over. Find that Dr. Entrati bastard on day one. Then I wouldn't be alone on New Year's Eve. Find out. 
made it to 1999 in one piece. But that thing is still on his heels. Albrecht rarely smiled after his return from the void. And never like that. I smashed the casket for nothing! It followed him anyway! Silence, creatures! It seems the murmur overloaded your connection. Unfortunately for Albrecht's cherished POM2, not as future-proof as the label claimed, alas. The murmur! They're attacking the sensory network I installed! Our eyes and ears! To arms, Tenno! Play the warrior, and leave the tactics to me. Construct, I'm awake. Your one responsibility is fulfilled. Be with the family. They must be kept in the state of ignorance to which my Albrecht so wisely consigned them. But I... Yes, I see. Until we meet again, Tenno. I'd crawl away in shame too if I'd done what Lloyd did. Doesn't that grimoire feel a little... light? The murmur presumes to destroy our auditory and visual senses. In all the time I have been asleep, they have never once been so bold. Here I... Shargon... Ignore the cover, Lieutenant. If Albrecht ever understood their babble, he never bothered to share that knowledge with me. Here they come! After all those years of creeping, silent encroachment, something has changed them, stirred them up. The Necromechs never could be compelled to attack the man. Albrecht suspected they could no longer distinguish between the indifference and himself. A theory he was reluctant. To confirm. There is a defense system of sorts. Gather enough of the floating Vosphine glyphs, and they should reinvigorate the organs you're here to protect. A fallback system, in case a promised operator with the show. There she is! 
shifting focus. Get to the victory! Look at them. The indifference. He could have given lessons in indifference. Call me! Lucy! Call me! Albrecht once thought the Carvia should have been destroyed. Failures all. But he briefly showed reluctance. And I saw no reason to punish them for his negligence. I saw off Granum's thugs. I beat back the infested. And by the void, I shall see the end of these monstrosities. yourself down, Tenor. We are still alive. Rejoin me, and the Kalimo sequence may proceed. You're right, Fish. Lloyd could never figure things out. We have nothing to worry about. If the Carvia have been babbling our secrets to the Murmur, I shall immolate the lot of them. Promise or no promise. It seems Albrecht said more than we heard. Despite the signal becoming corrupted, his words to you are preserved in the transference buffer. We should extract them. But for that, the POM-2 requires a replacement board. And those are all hidden away in the Netra cells. You do understand that accessing a Netra cell without a key glyph is completely impossible? A keyglyph? So, the Carvia have provided the very item we require. Very well. Proceed to the Netracel at your own risk, Tenno. That babbling oddity may be sending you into a trap, and if you do end up in one, I'm afraid you are on your own. Keyglyphs are a heavy burden. For living beings to bear. Each type will impede you in its own way. shall refrain from further outbursts. There, a Netracel. 
Albrecht has stored all manner of sentimental old junk in these. Insert the key. The Netrocell security apparatus is diligent. That door won't open while it consents the murmur nearby. So eliminate them. Necromites. The lab's automated systems are trying to lock down the Netrocell. Your only option is to destroy them. Excellent. Return to me with the boat, Tenor. Thank you. A moment, please. Would you do the honors? Arthur? Tenno? Hmm. Forgive me. I need Lloyd to understand why I had to leave. Without him. Why I forced him to destroy the device after I had gone. And why I could never say the words he so needed to hear. If I had remained in the Demos laboratory, Lloyd would never have been safe from him. You know of what I speak. And so I retreated to the only place in history where that entity could not easily follow. To draw his greedy eye away from Lloyd. Tenno, I require your trust. Craft the little curio whose blueprints you will find in the computer's memory. Complete the Kalimos sequence. Repair. Rebuild. When? The time is right. Find me. The skin of a martyr doesn't suit you, Albrecht. If something mattered, she'd have found a way. It's too late. You heard him, Tenno. He requires your trust. So craft the bloody thing. Tip top, kiddo. You don't want to be late again, do you? The Jahu Gargoyle. Bring it back here and we shall examine what form will do to help us. A 
Albrecht may have told you to build that thing, but given how he used people and threw them away, he may not have cared for your safety. If that gargoyle is a threat, you must take it from the Sanctum immediately. Now, activate it. At last! If ignorance is bliss, then you, Tello, must be ecstatic. Come on, then. Bring it closer. Wakey, wakey. Where did that come from? Identify yourself. Please, Lloyd. Let them figure it out. Here, in the jar. What? The fish with the big brain? Yes, the fish with the big brain! Can we please, finally, get this interminable process over with? Albrecht used you to give the Carvia a voice. Just as he used me to keep them alive. Such a resourceful man. So, here we are then. The best of what's left. Clearly, Papa's plan was countered. <laughs> Color me surprise. Right then, we may proceed with the sequence. You animals have observed us all this time, have you not? You've given yourself a role in the sequence? Indeed we have. <laughs> oh, come, Lloyd. It's named after Papa's favorite one. Eight. Spare the rod and spoiled. We know the fragmented ones are heralds of the indifference. We know the chosen operator must summon and destroy them. And regrettably, you, Lloyd, have made this impossible. Choose your words carefully, fish. Dinner. The grimoire is incomplete. The final page hidden away by Lloyd. Oh, be a darling and retrieve it. That's all, run it on. So be it. The gift of decency was clearly not bestowed upon the Carvia, Tenno. But I cannot deny the page's current status is lost. talk hey hey oh oh mr lloyd mr lloyd where is papa why did papa leave us mr lloyd papa is gone we can all be gone too in an instant like like we have to keep quiet okay allow me to boil this down for you should the indifference's corrupting touch reach us and take back our speech, we would be screwed. So, be a love and eradicate the murmur in this patch before the big bad gets word that Lloyd's awake and the fish is talking. Tenno, there is some truth to what the fish says. That page was the last thing my Albert ever wrote. Meant for me. Since I had no interest in reading his endless self-justifications, I hid it away instead. But with all this chaos, it's undetectable. As long as the indifference is missing a digit, it is confined to the strands of Kraa. Don't ask me, your tiny mind would likely pop under the strain of understanding. This limitation is our one hope. Do not patronize the Tenno fish. The strands of Kra are merely void renderings of the chains of cause and effect. Conceptually embodied timelines, if you will. Papa's daughter excelled at explaining complicated concepts in childish terms. I see now where she learned it. Arousing as I 
I'm sure this is you, the rest of us are moments away from an extinction grim, black, and final. Oh, so, if you would be so kind, finish up so I can point you toward that sodding page! Bravo! It was a long walk towards Cop. How about you give me the page instead, kiddo? Consider it part of our deal. It's done. Keep it to yourself, Tenno. I'm damned if I'm giving Albrecht the last word. Oh, uh, Phil Hand wraps her upon the untimed door and sends Grimoire. We are undone. Uh, we've been rumbled. Diverted your extraction jump. We need you back at the sanctum now. Hurry! Even when the galleries hurled scorn upon me, 
Your sole desire was to suffer it in my stead. On your first day of service, you aspired to be worthy of me. I only wish that I could have been worthy of you, my lord. remains undeterred. I foresee a grim and continuing struggle to safeguard Papa's laboratory from its fell and ruinous grasp. Indeed, I shall not waver. Protect the vessels, repair, rebuild. So runs the Kalimo sequence. And such is our task. In the version of the past we saw, my Albrecht said we were too late. The solution, naturally, is to arrive on time next time. You keep the murmur at bay, I shall fulfill my role. Punctuality. The Entrati family never could arrive on time without my help. And so, here I am. Back to my old role, the diligent servant. Albrecht would have smiled at that, I think. He said... My last sight of your face must not be marred by tears. Handshake. 
shape all it took. Though from the deal, the wee child ran. Yet still, we end as we began. <laughs>